Hey guys, so I got these two wands in the mail today, but I'm going to do two separate review videos on them. Um, first, I'm going to do this one because this is the one I actually bought first. And let me move all my keys and stuff out of the way. Okay, so this is the Wizarding World of Harry Potter's, one of their birthday wands. As you can see, Ollivander's. And this one's actually the wand of... Price tag, scan code right there. And actually, what does it say at the bottom? It says, this says Rowan 2, actually. I'm not sure. But the person that sold it... Let me see if I can get that to focus so you guys can see it. The person that sold it actually said it was the Elder, uh, the elder one. So actually, I am going to have to look at the picture I have for it because this is interesting. Hold on. See, I always have my binder handy. So let's flip it over. And we'll find out right now. Oh, okay, so I just opened it and the styrofoam inside the box is kind of breaking on the wand so this one actually has a swirly shaft so it is actually the wand of Rowan which is my birthday wand because it's swirly and over there it's more of a like a branch look for the elder wand so and never mind we're not gonna not gonna do a review video because I don't have the elder wand now I actually have the Rowan one, which is from the months of, let's see, where is it? Rowan one, from January 21st to February 17th. So, I'm going to have to fix all my paperworks and make little notes here on the side saying, no, the seller sold it to me wrong, because I actually bought this off of eBay. So. so, since this is not the elder one, it's the Rowan one. We're still going to do the review of the wand, but won't compare it since it's not the older wand. Okay, and let me make sure this one came right, because if not... Oh, yeah, that one's okay. Okay, so... I paid eighteen fifty plus $8 of shipping and handling, so I paid about $30-ish for it. And I got combined shipping for the both, and I got this one for seventeen fifty. But I explained that one later on, in its own video. So let's get to it. The boxes are always the same. Train more corner brush, all that. Let's get to the wand now. I'm gonna take this out from the background because it's gonna get in the way. <laughs> okay, there. I got all this. Okay. So, right off the back, you see the skull head. In very much detail, there is the trademark. And then it has the skeleton neck. And it goes into the swirls. It's a leaf pattern, and I've seen this leaf pattern before, I just don't know what wand it came off of. I think I have it too. Okay, so, yeah, but either way, it's a leaf pattern. Um, the only heavy part about this wand is the skull right here, because if I balance it on my hand, the skull is going to weigh it down to this side. Other than that, it's not heavy at all. Not one of my favorites. It's actually kind of ugly and scary looking though. But as you can see, it's a brown color. And it has the black in the inside. Looks like it's carved of wood. So they did a great job on the detail. If you guys have any questions, post down below. 
And that's it. And then on to the next video when I review that one. Until then, bye!